right, so it's an art project contest at George Washington High School to focus on helping stop gun violence with our youth. It is called Peace in the Streets. And it's the first time they've ever done this at this school. So Randall Newsom got to be there, see the art, and speak with some of the kids who have some powerful motivation behind mm -hmm. this. What was it? Yeah, so some of the kids were very motivated and talented, and they all used their part in their art to show what Peace in the Streets means to them. But I spoke with one girl who needed to be in this contest because it's helping her heal from the pain of the loved ones she lost too soon. Check it out. Four words started an entire movement at George Washington High School. Peace in the streets. Bringing light to a serious problem, young lives being cut short by gunshots. With the rise of, of gun violence, you know, especially with the, the victims and suspects getting, getting younger, we want to reach them. So an officer with a heart for the community decided she would reach them through art. Well, I feel like art is a way um, to express oneself. To get to the kids' input on what they thought about what if the streets really means to you. In the beginning, she only hoped for a handful of volunteers. And right now, I just want to open up their minds to different things because art can lead you to so much. It can lead you to murals. It can teach you to drawing, tattooing, architecture. So I just wanted to just open their eyes to the possibilities. Then before they knew it, they had a competition on their hands with 48 contestants. We didn't pressure them at all. It was all on their own, so it was wonderful. From the freshman to the senior class, they knew hitting home with this message was urgent. At that point, they make a lot of decisions on their own, and they think about consequences. Jocelyn Hammond is only a freshman, but like many of these kids, she knows the pain of those consequences all too well. I have a lot of friends that died this year. I do, and one of them, he did go here. This competition was the outlet she needed to deal with her pain. And for him not to have his life today, I feel like it's something I can be in for him. Not only for him, but for myself. She's using her art to heal and to heal others. It can show, like, you can lose a friend, but why mourn for the rest of your life when you can do stuff like this? Letting her art inspire and speak life in memory of the loved ones she lost. I'm here, and I can be their voice for peace, you know. And they hope to bring that message home here at George Washington and eventually all over the city. Powerful words from Jocelyn right there. You can see more of the kids' artwork on our website, wishtv.com. Just great so all around. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Awesome. Good yeah. stuff. Great mm -hmm. name for it as well. Yeah.